All right, here we go. We're gonna sure it says no bozos. All right, keep that confidence level up. Oh shit. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh no. This is not gonna be good. Ugh. So yeah, I had to take all those prickly things and thorns out of my baggy shorts and my mandex and my butt cheeks. Or should I say off-road damage. Hashtag dirt life. All right, bicycle's ready. Got the GoPro cam all ready to go. See how today goes. Should be fun. We're gonna take it and go a little bit like different trail, like maybe more of that Arizona trail, but go a little bit further. See how it goes. All right, here we are, it's fucking road again. Yeah, it looks like there's a trail right here. Put it on eco mode and hit the road. So these mountains right here are called the Rincon Mountains. You find so much weird stuff. Little air rest area right there. Oh, check this out. How you get over. So bicycle riders don't have to stop. There's usually these little bridge cattle guards. It's so fun, right? All right, now we got to figure out where the fucking trail goes. Oh, there it is. What's up, man? Oh, man, I'm heading to Utah, man. Oh, have fun. Have a good ride. Dang, did you hear that guy? That fucker's going to Utah. Holy shit. Talk about me being a pussy. Holy crap, man. That's insane. That's the world's cool. Okay, guys. So maybe that's bucket list, right? That dude's riding his bike to Utah. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I'm on an e-bike. That dude was on a regular bike. Holy shit. So one thing I forgot to mention was the trail that I'm riding is called the Arizona Trail. And it actually does go like all the way up towards Nevada, Colorado, Utah, all those places. So that's probably what this dude's doing. I don't know if you would want to ride this whole trail that far, but how cool is that, man? Sweet. All right, so this trail looks like it's a little bit more opened up. Maybe we can get with it a little bit more. Uh oh, okay. this. So we're doing 16 miles an hour, 17 miles an hour in eco mode, which is like first gear. So it still means I'm pushing pretty hard with my legs, which is awesome. But man, this trail's pretty badass. Oh, what? Uh oh. Whoa. Wonder if this show, the camera shows good elevation for you guys because this is like pretty good ups and downs. Oh, here we go. Slowing down, going up this hill. And even with the Z bike, it's still a lot of work. But hey, homeboy's going to Utah. Over there, you can see the mountains. Probably with his wide angle, it looks like they're really far away, but they're pretty close. The trail goes winding through here. Awesome, oh, fun. Yeah. Oh crap. All right, e bike. Let's do it. Yeah. Got that. Selfless plug, Broadway bikes, Trek Rail E7. Thanks, Scott and the boys. Oh, here's a random road, maybe side by side road, huh? Yeah, so, see, Arizona Trail. That's one thing cool about these e bikes, too, is that. You still really get, oh yeah, firm. You still really get the shifting and stuff. Oh man, the boy's getting tired. Look at how it just rounds all these hills. This is badass. I feel like I don't even care how tired I get because it's so cool. Whoa, whoa, damn, look at this. Shit, these flowers too. This is freaking sweet. Can you guys see that valley? Badass. Oh shit. Oh, I got it. I better unclip. All right. 
still got the world's suckiest mountain bike shoes, aka road shoes on. The bike is kind of a savior for me to walk through. So it's kind of like crutches actually. Oh dude, I could have easily made it through here. But if I didn't and I fell into that, that would suck. That's about six feet, eight feet down. So instead, we'll walk through. These spots of the rocks in the side hills really sketch me out. I don't want to fall face class. Oh, hey. Dude, this is badass. I'm proud of myself. Uh oh. Yeah, big tires coming in clutch. Shit. All right, we're going for it, people. Oh, shit. Oh, George down. So sometimes Mother Nature really helps you out. Whew. These tall rocks. So I didn't eat it too bad. Grab it on. Let's see what we can do to get back on. I feel like if I wasn't so timid, if I had more confidence, I would have just burned through there. I think if I can get my legs stronger and do this a few more times, like if it wasn't like my what, third time riding a mountain bike. All right, here we go. confidence George oh, that was not good. That was confidence you got this confidence yeah all right keep that confidence level up oh shit yeah fuck yeah oh no this is not gonna be good Ugh. fucking hit another one this one didn't feel that good I didn't feel good. Ouch. All right. Oh, man. Fell right in that fucker right there. All right, I got some pricks in my ass. Time out for George. We're in a shirt that says no bozos. Uh, update. Unfortunately, well, I saved the bike, but I fell into that bad boy right there. It doesn't look like much, but it's got a lot of prickles. So, I saved the bike. <sighs> Taking a little break. Looks like it's going to be kind of gnarly to get through here. But I was looking. I don't know if you guys can see it, but... Oh, where is it? It's a little bridge somewhere over here. So, it'll be kind of cool to cross that. And it goes all the way back into the valley over there pretty cool i think the trail probably goes up through there winds around should be pretty neat first oh and i think i forgot to mention my outfit my outfit might look like i got baggy shorts on look all cool but this is how all the mountain bike guys do it still got mandex underneath the big old belly excited to say so yeah I had to take all those prickly things and thorns out of my baggy shorts and my mandex and my butt cheeks. See you guys in a sec. And I really wish I had better shoes. And yeah, you guys told me after we post that other video, George, get some real mountain bike shoes. Dude, I know, I know. All right, come on. Thank you mountain bike for getting so much traction saving me yes i made it dude sweet oh that was gonna be way harder yes 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 Woo. and just so you guys know i'm using the trees to get on because i can't get my forward momentum and then clip my other foot in easy enough because my legs don't have that much accuracy so i can't do it quick enough to get going in like 10 feet if i had maybe 60 or 80 feet would be different. Oh yeah, there you go. Got it. Hell yeah. 
Oh shit, I lost my gloves. Ah. Now I gotta go back and get my gloves. I gotta go back all through that shit. Son of a bitch. There they are, the fuckers. Now I gotta crawl through all that shit. These fucking awesome shoes. Oh, all the way back. To the scene of the crime. Alright, you motherfucker. Let's sit down. So, this is the sucky part about being me. I have no control over my sinuses anymore. So I'm not sure if that's actual boogers or if it's still spinal fluid from the injury because it's just, it never stops. But the awesome part about being me is that I can live all this. And that. And all that. I'm having a good time today. Still got a bunch of stickers in my ass, but fucking A. Just noticed we got a little road damage too. Or should I say off-road damage? Hashtag dirt life. All right, let's try this again. This time with gloves on. Let's try it again. Okay. Let's do it. Please don't be a bunch of rocks ahead. Yes. Hopefully those stickers in my bum can work their way out. Also, it's way easier. Oh, look at this tree. Flower, whatever that is. Oh, dude, this looks badass. There's a big ass wash down there. All right, we're taking it easy. Let's catch our breath here. Oh, I took some gel too. Try to see if I could energize. Probably should go down this hill and look for cell phone service too. Oh shit. This is alright. George needs to pay attention. That tree's cool. Whoa, look at this. Well, if there's this much of a downhill, that means there's another uphill, so. You better fucking pay attention. Alright, normally I would like bomb through this shit. Oh wow, look at that. Little area to take a too bad I didn't have to take a break just a minute ago. Oh look it. How fun is this? What's up man? How's it going bud? Oh that's cool. Oh, I think I know exactly where we are. Let's cruise around and then we can hit the trail again. So, so far we have done nine miles today. Looks like they got this nice little area back here. So now I know for the next ride, as long as I make it through those nasty sketchy sections, I can rest here. Look at how fun this is. Little grill area. Dude, the stuff you find in the middle of the desert, right? I was wondering, who on their mountain bikes, their right hand doesn't like going around the bars. For some reason, this is so uncomfortable, but this is just fine. Like, I don't get why that's uncomfortable. My left hand, I'm not worried about it. But this is like super uncomfortable, I don't know. Let me know, boys and girls. Yes. Dude, you never know what's around every corner. I don't really feel like eating it anymore today. So one thing I noticed is that, whoa, this is cool. I eat it about one to four times. All right. Ugh. 
Oh, good thing we turned it up into the next block. There we go. Oh, shit. This doesn't look good. Oh, how am I gonna make this? A little pit stop on this rock. Yeah, we back going. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Fuck oh, yeah. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. No way. Yes. Oh, that was so sketchy. Fuck, I'm tired. I thought this was getting like to the easy part of the trail. What the heck, man? Uh oh. What do we got here? Oh, road. Huh, where the fuck this goes? Let's see what happens. All right. Better save some battery on the GoPro for later. Oh, I should have kept the GoPro rolling. It's fucking A, look at that drop off. Holy crap. We just had to go up this big ass hill. This is fucking sketchy, man. Next time I think I'm gonna give myself a little bit more understanding of what the trail's like before I go. Cause damn, this is gnarly. All right. We had a pretty good crash right into that thing. But it's better than going down there. But there was a sign back there that said, caution, watch your speed. So I slowed down when I should've just fucking sped up. Got a cool dead saguaro right here. Nice, what, 200 year old saguaro? All flowers on top of it. So I've been struggling get down that hill for about 20 minutes finally got some cell phone service so <sighs> let a couple people know how I was doing but check this out I come up to the sign here it says we can do it and then it has colossal cave which is way up there on top of the hill right there with all these lines of what I think are cottonwood trees and then the trail. It's pretty cool, man. The little things that change your outlook. Oh, time to uh, get a little bit of uh, energy. Probably take some gels and hit the road right there. All right, so we made it through that little valley. Going into this other valley, looks like the land of freaking saguaros. Look at that. Ooh, I think I might turn right here and head back. I think that's probably a smarter idea. I don't know where this goes. Maybe that wasn't such a good idea. Let's see what the sign says. Bedrock Mortars Equestrian Arizona Trail. I don't know. I think we should probably just go this way. If it's a horse trail, we could probably make it. I need to start heading back because I don't have that much water left. So I think it's probably best to head back this way. I think maybe I should turn around and keep on the Arizona trail. What do you guys think? This way or that way? Nothing. Actually, I'm going this way. There's a little sign up there. Let's see what happens. Oh shit. This is probably not a good idea. I need to just go back to the Arizona Trail. Well, today is the day of the diggers. I fucking ate it again. I got so lucky this time. It landed right there. You can see where my hand hit. Almost with my hand in that cactus. My head brushed against that prickly pear. Landed in those rocks. I didn't feel good, but at least I didn't go on the cactus. Saved the bike too, so. Whew. I need to really take a break, get my thoughts together and start making the right decisions. 
All right, so we didn't have any success, so we're gonna just head back the way we came. Shit was just getting too gnarly. So we're going back up the Arizona Trail the way we came. Hopefully we don't eat shit. I kind of wish I just had a hike going with like walking sticks or something. So I'm walking again. But what I need to do is quit being such a sourpuss and put this in perspective again. Because this is actually pretty cool if I wasn't doing this. Probably be on the freaking couch or something. Just sitting there doing nothing. All right, so we made it back to the road. Boogers and all. Pretty gnarly. Had to walk a lot, but. Got some water at this little camping spot. Now we head back. We're going home. Got some battle wounds. I don't know if you guys can see them. Still on my arm. But now that I take a, or taking a little break, it's fucking hot for now. Go home. Get some iced tea. Call it a good day. Woo. Well, we made it back home without dying. So that's good. Check out these freaking cleats man those shoes are toast sucks gotta get some calories back in me got some water though that's good and uh so this is all the data for the ride looks like about 17 miles dude i probably walked at least a mile or two all that crap what's fun man i'm stoked so dirt life show tomorrow it's gonna be an awesome one can't wait, got so many people calling in. See you guys there.